Hi, my name's Luke. And I'm Mari. And these are your Monday morning announcements. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance and respecting a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Do you want to check out books and read quietly in the library but have no time in your schedule? If so, sign up for the Open Library Tutorial. Please note that this is not a study tutorial. Students will be required to check out a book and read for most of the tutorial. Spanish Honor Society is now accepting applications for the 2017-2018 school year. They work with the community, fundraise to help Latino families, tutor students that are learning Spanish as a second language, and represent North and their love of culture at Lotus Blossoms. You may pick up an application in room 407. All of the sophomore class will report to the auxiliary gym for PSAT testing by 7.45 a.m. as testing starts at 8 a.m. on Wednesday, October 11th, 2017. This is the day after a four-day fall break, so please don't forget. This also applies to juniors and freshmen who have registered at the bookstore to take the test. Please bring two sharpened pencils, a blue or black ink pen, and a calculator. You may also bring a closed container of water to keep on the floor next to your desk. No backpacks, phones, or communication devices are allowed in the testing area. Please put those in your lockers before coming to the gym. To see examples of the test, you may go to www.collegeboard.org and click on PSAT slash NMSQT to see sample questions. Leftover yearbooks will go on sale next week for $65 in the cafeteria during lunch. This will be your last chance to purchase these old yearbooks, so get them before the memories are gone forever. Now on to 84 Feet with Phil Beck. Hello and welcome to 84 Feet with Phil Beck. My guest today is Mr. Michael Akers. Mr. Akers is the newest principal at Bloomington High School North. We're going to get to know him a little bit by walking 84 feet and having a little chat. Mr. Akers, you ready to roll? Yes, sir. All right, here we go. Mr. Akers, I know when you came to town, you didn't know much about Bloomington. Tell us what you found that you like here so far. Well, actually, I was in Bloomington for about five years. I got my undergrad here, and uh, I consider Bloomington kind of a second home for me. I like coming down here on the weekends. I like going down to the point and, and the lake, so it's it's not you're, exactly foreign to me. You're a lake guy. Yes, I am. Swimming and boating. Uh, boating. 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 Okay. Do you own a boat? I do not, but I like to rent boats. Aha! Uh -huh. Very good. What's your favorite uh, thing to eat, Mr. Acres? What's your favorite food? I like uh, pizza from Mother Bears. Oh yes. Well, a lot of people around here like that. That's for sure. Uh, Mr. Acres, what would be your favorite movie that you've ever seen? Uh, Forrest Gump. Forrest Gump. It's got a great message. Yes, it does. Uh, Mr. Akers, where'd you come from before you were here? I came from Indianapolis. I was a assistant principal at North Central High School. I was there for 21 years, and I am so glad to be here in Bloomington and at Bloomington High School North. Well, we're happy to have you. We appreciate you walking with us today. Thank you. This All has right, been sir. Mr. Michael Akers, principal at Bloomington High School North. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Welcome to 84 Feet with Phil Beck. My guest today is Gayla McAdams. Ms. McAdams is one of our new assistant principals at Bloomington High School North, and today we're going to walk 84 feet and get to know her a little bit. You ready to go? I'm ready. Here we go. Let's move. Ms. McAdams, what did you do last year? You, I saw you around the building last year. Why were you here then? I was the department chair for special education and case conference coordinator. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, that sounds like an important job. It's fun. Okay. Uh, what do you like to do around Bloomington? Is there a place in Bloomington you'd like to go hang out? Any place outside. I like parks and farms and orchards. You live on a farm? I used to. You used I don't to? anymore. Were you a farmer on a farm or you just lived on one? I used to have beef and swine and I was in 4-H. Do you have any animals nine, now? I have four dogs. I used to have seven. I like to foster. What happened to dogs. the other three? Two of them passed and one was adopted. Oh, good for you. Uh, what is your favorite restaurant to visit around the Bloomington area? I like to stop at the Hoosier on my way home. Uh huh. And that's the Hoosier salad. in Ellisville? Yes. Uh huh. Very good. Thank you for walking and talking with us today. This has been Gayla McAdams, Assistant Principal, Bloomington High School. Hello, welcome to 84 Feet with Phil Beck. My guest today is a student at Bloomington High School North. This is Delfina Ogando. Delfina and I are about to walk 84 feet and get to know a little bit more about her. Here we go. You ready? Yeah. All right, let's walk, Delfina. 
Delfina, yeah. you are what class in this uh, school? Um, I am a junior. You're a junior. Yeah. All right. What do you plan to do in your future? Do you have something in mind? Uh, I'm not really sure. I'm like all over the place. I think maybe I want to be a psychologist. Uh huh. What do you like studying at Bloomington High School North? Um, I definitely loved studying psychology last year, but my two favorite subjects would have to be English and science. English and science. Good. Mm -hmm. Those are good things to be good in, right? <laughs> True, yeah. What's your favorite food, Delfina? Um, I love milanesas. Um, they're um, a really popular food where I'm from in Argentina. They're like ah. breaded meat, yeah. Oh, very good. You're from Argentina. <laughs> mm -hmm, uh -huh. yeah. How long have you been in the United States, Delfina? Um, I've been here almost all my life. Uh, I moved here when I was two years old. Okay, well, yeah, you have no accent whatsoever, so I would have yeah. never even guessed. <laughs> yeah. Um, Delfina, what is it that you like most to do in your spare time on weekends? Um, or I love listening to music and hanging out with my friends. What kind of music do you like? Um, I love all kinds except for Who's your favorite music? artist? Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande. You yeah. have it right there from Delfina <laughs> Ogando. Thank you for walking with us Thank today. Thank you. Come together. Hello, my name is Timmy Negasi. I'm a senior here in Bloomington High School North. I'm from Eritrea, which is in East Africa. Um, the fun fact about Eritrea is Eritrea has no official national language, but Tigrinya is the most largely spoken in Eritrea. Thank you. Welcome to Dining with Doria. I'm Doria Day. Today's lunch consists of meatball sub, potato wedges, green beans, and seasonal fruit. For Tuesday, country chicken with gravy, wheat roll, broccoli cuts, mashed potatoes, and seasonal fruit. For Wednesday, chicken and cheese quesadilla, Mexican rice fiesta, sriracha pinto beans, and seasonal fruit. For Thursday, chicken smackers, spiral fries, seasoned California blend vegetables, assorted muffins, and seasonal fruit. And for Friday, crazy nachos, refried beans, Mexican rice fiesta, and seasonal fruit. And of course, assorted juices. Thank you, and now on to Maddie with upcoming events. Hey, my name's Maddie, and these are some of this week's upcoming Cougar events. Boys and girls cross country have their sectional meet Saturday, October 7th at BNL. Boys and girls soccer have their sectional game Monday, October 2nd at 5 o'clock p.m. at Terre Haute. Senior night for the volleyball team is Tuesday, October 3rd against Southport at 7 o'clock p.m. at home. Senior night for the football team is Friday, October 7th against Southport at 7 o'clock p.m. at home. Come out and support your kids. Back to Luke and Mari. Thanks, Maddie. Remember to respect yourself, respect others, be responsible for your own actions, and remember, it's, it's great, great to be a cougar. cougar.